hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm not too sure if i'm gonna upload this get around to editing it or even finish filming it but today is my dissertation results day and i have filmed a lot around my dissertation on youtube obviously months back when i was in lockdown that's when i began writing it if you ever actually get to watch my isolation diary video you would see me uploading it and submitting it so i thought that i would maybe film me opening it even though i'm just a small youtube channel i feel like i've kind of shared this whole like dissertation journey with you guys i am on placement today it is my first day of my last week on my virtual placement and next week i go back out into the hospital on a general children's ward which i I'm really excited for so just excuse my whole mess life is really stressful at the minute um with preparing for that placement with getting covid tests just in case and with lockdown and everything i just feel like i haven't filmed in so long i'm just all over the place is that my door oh my gosh today is such a stressful monday <laughs> so it's a busy monday but all i can think about is my dissertation results it is now half 12 and they're still not uploaded and i'm not actually refreshing my computer i just wait until someone puts on the group chat that they're up and honestly i feel sick to the stomach every time i think about it my stomach flips and i feel like this is just going to be a real open and honest youtube video if it ever actually gets out there and if i ever finish it like i'm close to tears already and i haven't even got my results yet i have a really bad feeling that it's not going to be what i wanted it to be but at the end of the day i have worked so hard on this throughout the last however many months and it's not going to define me and who i am as a nurse it's not going to define whether i'm a good nurse or a bad nurse and as long as i get a pass that's ultimately all i need isn't it um so we'll see how this video goes i even managed to get some really nice dissertation photos down by the uea lake um even though it's absolutely freezing it was a really nice sunny day um so they're up on my instagram i will put them here as well because they are so cute so if you want to check out that post it was quite an open and honest post for something that i put on instagram which i don't normally do since i last uploaded to my youtube and actually edited something i have hit 400 subscribers which is definitely so delayed from my goal of 500 by the end of october or whatever it was but i didn't think that i'd get hit by the problem of not being able to export any of my videos so actually not being able to upload to youtube and continue with my channel for the time being um obviously has been hard and i don't expect to gain subscribers while i'm not uploading but i have hit 400 and that does mean the world and it's 400 more than i had in march when i started this channel which is amazing and i hope an open honest video like this just shows how much like it means to me and the support honestly i've just got the best people around me and that i think that's just why i really want to do well in this dissertation <laughs> and like i don't want to build it up like the thing is it's not like life changing it's not end of the world but for me like this dissertation has been a good like my whole part of 2020 it's been the thing that i've been focusing on the most and stuff yeah i'm just absolutely bricking it i am just trying to pass the time before the results actually get uploaded <laughs> but i will keep you guys updated also i am very aware that i literally look like casper the ghost um but it is because firstly my ring light broke just adds to the disaster of my youtube career really doesn't it i really don't think i'm destined to do this but oh well and it is so dark outside and so white and rainy and just awful that like i've got no good lighting around here i literally look like i've been pulled through a bush backwards such a monday vibe five to three and i still haven't got the result and it's literally just a waiting game now i've done work i've had lunch i've been on a walk went to the post office like i'm ticking things trying to tick things off my to-do list to pass the time because i'm literally driving myself crazy i just have a feeling the results are going to be out at three which is in three minutes <sighs> nothing yeah Oh, I feel sick just looking at it waiting. Still nothing. Maybe it's because I failed. Maybe it's so bad that he didn't even mark it. Here we go again. Do they not realise? Like, surely they've been marked for so long. Why can't they just upload them already? This is actually, like, testing me. Okay, apparently they are out. So I'm going to have a little look now. I feel really sick. My heart is literally going at a million miles an hour here we go i got first i got 76 which 
just want to point. I am happy. I'm really happy. 76. Which is a pass. I can't, like, actually believe it. Like, I generally had such a bad feeling. And now I don't know who to tell. Like, I literally have a meeting in five minutes. I have a meeting in five minutes. And I've got to hold myself together. And then after the meeting, I'm going to ring my mum and my dad. Because they're the people I want to tell first. But yeah, I'll be back. I feel like I've pulled myself together a bit more. I don't know what I'm doing. It's just, it, this is so surreal. Because I feel like, even though it's just an assignment, I'm like... Like, I just feel like it's been such a big part of my year. 2020 has been such a hard year to then, like, and I've done this in the middle of lockdown. Like, I started this when coronavirus started, didn't have a library, didn't know what I wanted to do it on, chose my subject in, like, a week. It was kind of a bit panicky rushed because I kind of just got it thrown at me that I had to write it there and then um, to then kind of work on it the whole of summer and the whole of lockdown, submitting it during isolation with coronavirus to now being here near the end of 2020 and that again a first but it's actually mad i didn't expect that at all hard work pays off doesn't it there is actually no better feeling in the world than like making the people like that you love proud anyways this will make you guys laugh told my boyfriend that um obviously my results and stuff and i'm really happy he's like oh so proud of you i'll win a game of cod tonight in your memory i was like i'm not dead i'm not dead and like what do i get out of you winning a game of call of duty nothing i still haven't stopped crying like oh look how bad i look molly literally just snapped at me like molly's literally like my rock through this and she's absolutely smashed her dissertation as well like like she has smashed it to the point of which it can be published and she was just like ellie we have just written a first class dissertation in a global pandemic and the fact that we've both done this and we're both so happy i'm gonna go and i'm gonna buy a bottle of prosecco and i'm gonna drink it to myself and i've just remembered to celebrate i have a misguided delivery coming between four and six and it is now 24 past four so guys that is literally my vlog it has been a short and sweet one and i'm an emotional mess i am just so happy and i hope it kind of inspires you guys a little bit to work hard it all pays off in the end doesn't it i just think i knew how much hard work and how many tears and breakdowns and stresses and everything went into that dissertation and to come out with that result which is all i wanted but yeah thank you guys for watching and thank you for your endless support it honestly means the world don't forget to like comment and subscribe and check out my social medias which i'll put right here like usual i am only a message away if you want to ask me any questions any advice anything like that i will see you all in my next video